Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight. Welcome back to RimWorld. When we last left off, uh, we were just building things up, as I had said at the time. I was going to fast forward a little just to, uh, you know, try and get some more stuff done. Uh, which is slowly but surely happening. Uh, our colony is getting there. I'm just going to have this little dumping stockpile for our animal corpses. Only fresh, please. And let's, uh... uh who are our top builderizers? Alex and Buns. Okay, so Buns, if you don't mind working on that cooler, you can work on the other one. Uh, we need to get the cooler up and running. We need to start acquiring resources to make food. We also need more... You know what? Instead of just doing this one by one, I'm pretty sure most of these are ready to go. Uh, I do need to address the fact that... Uh, what is it that I need to address? I need to address that there are some zombies wandering off in the corner over there. We'll grow some cactuses, and the reason for that is because off-camera I was kind of looking at things, and as you can see here, uh, five days to grow, 30 yield, whereas the Drago tree, it has a yield of 50, but it takes three times as long to grow, so basically the cactus is more efficient. I really do love that music. Also, I think hopefully, like, what are we, four episodes in? I think I finally got the audio balance right, maybe, possibly, question mark? Been a little bit of fiddling around to get that where I'd like it. But anyway, let's look at our shamblers. Small group of two shambling corpses is approaching. The inhuman force that animates them is fading, so they will collapse within a day. But we can capture it for anomaly knowledge. So, let's have a look. It's just kind of shuffling around. We have 15 hours to decide what we're going to do. It might be better to just leave them. Uh, what's this? We can draw shamblers. So, perform a psychic ritual, which will draw a horde of animated corpses. While hostile, the corpses won't attack your colony directly. So what could be useful about that is we could call in an army of zombies in order to fight our enemies for us. Which, I mean, not bad. Let's uh, try to get all these stones out of here. Uh, we are getting dangerously low on food, so that is a bit of a concern. Uh, continued unhappiness. You're a body purist. Oh, that counts for genetics too, doesn't it? So our Hussar here. I mean, you got some good stuff going on, but... Uh, yeah. I'm also kind of wondering if it would be better... Because I've been just sort of thinking about how uh, RimWorld works and how uh, much of a crapshoot uh, shooting can be in the vanilla game. Since, you know, there's a number of mods that kind of make uh, your shooting skill get closer to, uh, I'm not going to say perfect accuracy, but more accuracy the higher you are. Uh, but I mean, like, getting into punching distance is possibly better. Now, in the vanilla game, we can't have, um, we can't wield a gun and a sidearm. We need mods for that, and since we're trying to play vanilla-like, we, you know, don't, we won't have that. So, uh, also, I think something we need to do is get our power creation indoors. So I think what I'm going to do is put half of our power over here for now. Eventually, we're going to want to have, like, a dedicated power room. Uh, right, I do kind of need it to all connect, don't I? But then again, I could do something like this. And actually, I could put you up here because then it's all still connected on the same line, and we'll get a bit more stuff going on there. All right, so I, I think that'll that'll be good. I think this should produce enough for us. Uh, and we just need to hunt one 
one singular elephant, and that should provide us with enough meat to go for a while. Uh, let's go ahead and work on this electric stove. Oh, what's happened? Oh no! A sad... a sad wander. That's the last thing we needed. Oh, good lord. Okay, it's just it's just one elephant by itself, though. How fast is this elephant? 4.46 versus Alex's... Uh, what is your running speed? 4.6, so you're slightly faster than the elephant. How about now? So you can outrun the... These are not Manhunter. Good, good. Okay, and you are now going to go haul stuff. So this elephant will slowly bleed out. Maybe I should get someone like Derek over here. What is Derek doing? Uh, Derek, you can grab that steel some other time. I want you to just keep an eyeball on the elephant. And we better bring our butcher table in here. Aiden, you're cutting some stone, which is important. But let's, uh, you know, maybe take care of some of this stuff and get our... Uh, bricks and blocks inside. Alright, so it's all coming together. A little bit. Little bit by bit. James, what are you doing? Oh, you're hunting the elephant. So, Derek... Good job, James. You are truly a master hunter. Yuso is going to get horribly boned, so maybe you should run away. There we are. A little bit of kiting. That always works. All right, good. Everyone's happy, especially me. Uh, we have no research ongoing. So, what do we want to research? Wonderful. Uh... Blur, 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 what would be important to me at this particular moment in time. Not that. Not g not just yet. Ooh, locust armor. Maybe, uh, ah, being able to build more hospital beds, bioregeneration, that would also be handy. Then we could get rid of some of these scars and things. Alright, we are giving birth to assorted horses, so that's good. Which reminds me, with our pen settings, uh, what is the word I'm looking for? This is not what I'm looking for, actually. Uh, where, ah, auto slaughter. So, uh, let's say we want four adult males and, uh, or maybe, well, we do want a reasonable number of horses. Maybe six females to two males. Or three males. Five, five and three. And then anything in excess of that we will slaughter for food and lever. But mostly food. And also you. You need... We need a little butcher creature action going on here. All right, so that's good. Uh, it is not getting cold in here because we do not have any any doors in place. So let's get those doors going. Uh, eventually, we'll want a security door. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> It'll be off center. Gaslight, you fool! You didn't stop to check how large those doors were. Oh yeah, and also we need... Uh, I guess I kind of want to make lavish meals first. That's too many. Because then we can start getting some mood bonuses. We'll kind of see how things work out uh, and decide if we need or want for that matter. Oh, you need a minimum of eight anyway. Okay, so we don't really need to do anything there. We'll pause it. Uh, when it is, and then unpause at 10. The general thinking here is we make four at a time. So, 
yeah, when we're down to 10, then that means, you know, we've got half of how much is there, and then we can construct some stuff, and hopefully things work out eventually. All right, good. So there we go. How are, How is our food? We are, we still have 10, so uh, we should be able to start cooking. Alex is kind of, what is this? You want one colonist, 13 years or older, for eight days. Who is Saburo and do we... You're a child spy who follows the Archonic Path. Cool. Uh, don't like any of that. And you are... I mean, you're steadfast, so that's good. But you are a tortured artist. So... Yeah, I wouldn't want that. The Glitter World Medicine, not bad. Goodwill, also good. And, I mean, we could get some Menace Pods, but... I don't know if I want to deal with that, is the thing. I don't want to deal with it, so I won't. For now. Alright. Didn't you just come back from a major break? We need a priest. You're also soaking wet. That is unfortunate. Uh, blah, 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 blah. All right, so, I mean, we're kind of at peace right now, so I think at this juncture I am going to maybe just kind of be zoomed out, fast forward, and we'll just kind of see how our colony gets along, because I don't think there's much that I personally need to do other than just wait to see for thing or wait to see how things come together based on the instructions I have given thus far. Okay, so the Covenant of Jeppo, bunch of pigmen. Oh dear. Transport pods. My least favorite form of pod. Well, at least when. Or. Oh dear. How many of these guys are showing up? How screwed am I? Five, six. I mean, at least they didn't arrive immediately. Six, twelve. So twelve of these villainous fiends. Do I dare wake up the entire squad? Okay, so those two are going to arrive first. I mean, I guess... Oh, and there was a social fight, so... People are... injured to begin with. That's, you know, much less good. Are you wearing a... A gun shooty holster thing? The answer is yes. Alright, have all the people who have guns wake up. Now, buns with his bad back and artery blockage. Probably not gonna be our, our best, uh, <laughs> Our best, uh, you know, job person. Uh, make wart forever. If there's wart to be had, make it. Uh, thinking of. I feel like I may be screwed here, but uh, time will tell. Let's get our hops in. Actually, you know, seeing as Buns is, you know, as old and slow as he... Why? Why are the guys without armor on the front line? <laughs> Come on. Work with me here, game. Also, I sh should have had these guys standing. What the heck? I mean, I guess we can't see you. I don't think I've ever actually seen a character wearing a burka in this game yet. Kinda caught me a little by a surprise. So how easily do pigmen die? The answer is... They're kinda slow. Alright, so... Oh jeez, we haven't even taken out the first two! <laughs> God damn it! Though if I recall correctly, melee is 
much, much stronger in uh, Vanilla Rim World. Okay, one group is fleeing, so, you know, forget about them. Uh, let's try to move everyone over here. Uh, no, the crossfire will be between... I mean, there's no cover. I can just tell this ostrich is going to get shot. But yeah, you run away. The ostrich is totally going to get shot, and that's going to cause me some problems, isn't it? Yeah, you, you have a... You're wearing... Hey, you, so I like... I appreciate your bravery, but uh, maybe don't stand on the front line when you have... Okay, important life lesson that's occurring to me as well. I need to set up more areas of cover and, like, multiple fallback positions. So... I mean, if I... Maybe have some stuff, like, along the roads. Though lighting... Lighting... Maybe not the best idea. And I'm kind of thinking maybe I should put, like, walls or, like, impassable terrain in between. We're, we're going to see how this ends up working out for me at some point. Do I outrange? I mean, you have just a stabby thing. You have a... I mean, we're going to get some more guns, so some of our people who do not have defensive weaponry will be able to get defensive weaponry. That's good. So you you can't fight back, huh? I'm going to put Manning over here, then. That way, the people who can't, who can't ever fight will go in the back. We also should, assuming, like, they don't instantly die, which they're all instantly dying. Very unfortunate for me. Also, I guess the pigmen will feed the blood trees. What else is going on? Oh yeah, you're, ru you're running away. Like, as you can see here, we need more cover. Can I start building... Oh, there's steel barricades. I don't want steel barricades. Let's get rid of... The oh my god, What? why are you over here? What were you doing? I don't know what he was trying to accomplish there. Did you just die? Okay, so they're, they're running. We also got another gun. Unfortunately, they're all instantly dying, which is bad for me because it means... It means I don't get any of their loot. Oh, sweet. No, don't destroy my fences. <laughs> Damn you, ostrich. Okay, don't, don't fly or it will. And again, the game taunts me by putting the people with no... My precious fences. Okay, now you can fire at will. And take out this guy, please. I heard someone throw something. But I don't see what got thrown, so... Oh no, James is down! Okay, you've taken out one pig, man. If we take out, like, one or two more... Damn, you taking out my fence gate. At least the ostrich is doing God's work. Or Randy's work, or he's doing someone... Oh my god. Oh my god, buns! Now, I do want to point out that I am very, very, you know, I want to get the guy with fire away from my people who are... James, James, you got up! Oh no, you're crawling to a bed. Okay. I'd actually really like it if you could kill Strange. They've decided to kidnap who they can and leave. That could work in my favor. Because if they're focused on... Yeah, if they're focused on uh, that instead of... Oh, lord. 
Wait, is James up? No, you're still crawling ahead. Okay, they are crawling. Oh god, Yuso's down. Uh, maybe get behind cover. I do, I do recognize the foolishness of uh, how I have set up a lot of this. Okay, quick, rescue, uh... Hey, okay, just stop where you are. Hey, just, just flee. Flee, you dirty cowards. All right. I feel at this point, if I turn everyone off, they'll just, or, you know, unrecruit everyone, they'll, they'll take care of themselves. God, did I not get a single possible prisoner? What am I hearing? Ah, they're eating my hops! I mean, I guess that's okay, though. So, are you guys just not gonna rescue our fallen... our fallen comrades? Thanks a lot. Guess I could have woken some people up here. Oh lord. Uh, doctor? Manning? Where's Manning? Manning. Okay, you are doctoring. You are very upset. Lots of rebuffness. Eight cook... Wait, that's a thing? Fungus is despised? Well, then why did you eat it? <laughs> you damn fool. Uh... uh. If you don't like fungus, don't eat it. Uh, I don't know if that'll cause you a problem. It might. Oh, I guess I need to remove fungus from meals. Bloody hell. Who had fungus then? Why? Fuck with fungus if you don't like it. Oh, well, that's life. Okay, buns, you are no longer... But I turned self tend on for everyone. Apparently not. Or maybe I did, and then I. I don't know. Some people have it on. Not everyone. I kind of wish self tend was toggled on by default, because you still have to give them a doctoring job. Or actually, wait, I'm a fool, isn't there? And there's a quick toggle somewhere. I thought maybe there is, and I just don't know where it is. It does sound plausible. Okay, how bad is it? Two hours. Well, I mean, I guess this is good doctoring. So the whole, uh, you know, capturing people for uh, medical treatment. Hayden, I swear to God, if you... Wait, aren't you with the doctor? I did set you to doctor, didn't I? Yeah, yeah Manning, you're supposed to be a doctor. And the buns. Oh yeah, I forgot you could uh, manually romance people. Because you know, the more the more pairings we get, the less bedrooms we need. Okay, Yuso is still in a medical emergency. Everyone else has been treated. That that could have gone better. Could you, uh, how about we haul the corpses out of here? Let's make that a, uh, priority first and foremost, shall we? Uh, also, maybe, maybe clean the, the, oh yeah, that's right, another, uh, 1.5 thing is now we can just, like, just click, one click and, like, order to clean the entire dang room. That's so nice. Why are you feeding him raw meat? Why are we out of food? <laughs> oh, Lord. Hey, okay, let's, uh, maybe get, uh... Okay, so apparently we don't have any... Just... Okay, get, get simple meals. Do until you have 10. I pause at 5, why not? 
Oh lord. Bloody hell. <laughs> anyway, this is of course why it's important to... Why it's important to make sure that you, uh, you know, have adequate security, which, you know, evidently I didn't. Starting to think maybe setting difficulty to 200% was a... a bad idea. Uh, maybe hauling should actually be a, a higher priority than cleaning. I mean, I like... I like having, uh... Let's get these charge rifles in before they degrade. I'm pretty sure the the quality doesn't affect uh, how they are, but it might. All right, so we do need a priest, and our best warden is Manning. God damn. <laughs> uh. Right. I mean, we could just put down a ritual spot just to just to take care of this. Uh, yes. Just, just do it. Because once we have the priest, that'll at least, uh, you know, get rid of... What is this? Observed corpse. Wonderful. Uh, yeah. That'll take care of that. Uh, we do have a number of animal handlers, don't we? Failed! Are you... <laughs> Why is this a thing? Everyone get your ass in there and do the damn job! Which takes ten hours, apparently. One hour. As you can tell, I am mildly angry and salty about this situation. Oh, and it's only going to get worse once, because Manning's going to have higher expectations. Frightened sheep? Okay, we'll worry about that later. Oh, Lord. Browsy. Hungry. Ate raw food. Well, yeah, eat a, eat a proper meal. Okay, what's his quest? Sheep are sick with blood rot, huh? Healer mech... Healer mech... Ooh chem reactor. That's good. I think the healer mech serums are probably important. Five sheep for 24 days. Daily treatment. I don't think I get the mech serum until the 24 days is over, so I do have to keep the sheep alive that long, which is possibly troublesome. I mean, I'll accept it because why not, I guess? Why not? With the way everything's going. Put some uh, sleeping spots down here. I hope these corpses get dealt with in a in a timely fashion. Uh, you know what? I'm going to allow human-like corpses here as well. Just to maybe get them out of here sooner. Are you still wandering around in a daze? You are. It's 10 million years. Uh, we still have some animals wandering away, but, you know, hopefully that'll be taken care of. And life, uh, where are your expectations? Sky high expectations. Oh lordy. Why are strangers wandering into my Oh right, 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 we've got people under our care. You can't do any work. That's unfortunate. You're gonna have mental breaks. I can guarantee it. Gonna happen. <laughs> gonna happen. Uh I guess. Put some additional sleeping spots in here. No, no, I should put them over here. Or over here. Try to... Try and minimize the odds that, uh... 
that will end up with the disturbed sleep modifier. More cooking needs to be done. Manning is... He's not gonna... Okay, it's a very impressive barrack, so at least it's plus one. Uh, but I'm thinking maybe put Manning in here. Because now he's gonna be in a... A much greater likelihood of uh, going insane. Uh, what about your room? Do you have you have no opinions of your room just yet? You ate without a table, of course you did. And all right, you guys, maybe out of the way. Don't go into the barracks, please. I mean, it's kind of my fault for having the barracks here. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to give Buns is an old man, so I kind of feel like he deserves his own room. Sooner rather than later. Uh, Rena also going crazy. So you probably deserve uh, a room as well. Things are uh, <laughs> they're falling apart pretty fast here, I feel. That troubles me. And uh, who else? It's probably a smart idea. Where's Derek in? Derek is also on the verge of going crazy. Why do we care about corpses? But I'll, I'll stick Derek in there. All right, so we, we've almost got everyone out of the barracks. We just need a couple of people to, uh, you know, pair up. Animal's still wandering away. Hunter lacks suitable weapon. Right, I do have to manually do something about that, don't I? Because it's a mod that makes you remember what gun you had. Fortunate for me. Uh, where are the guns? I need a gun shelf. Not equipped. Oh, right, you're incapable of violence. The whole thing we went over a while ago. Uh, buns. Yuso? Did you so have the charge rifle? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and have him equip it at any rate. And there's just a gun lying out here. Alex has a gun, Yuso does not have a gun, uh, Buns is going to grab a gun. Alright, good. So I, I think that manages everything, and at this point it's probably time to wrap the episode up, so until the next time, as always, thank you all for watching, I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button, or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking. And I will see all you next time.